A hundred years ago, I don't think anybody would have said that machine intelligence was inevitable or even possible. But something happened uh, around the turn of the century. It was discovered that machines could do more than anyone had dreamed. It was implicit in the work of some mathematicians. And then uh, the great logician Gödel discovered that it was possible for a machine to represent itself, represent its own workings. And that was the first glimmering of the idea that a machine could simulate another machine or simulate itself. The idea that a machine was an infinite source of variations uh, is a new idea. And uh, so I think it is a new step in evolution. There's never been anything like it or an idea like that. You see, until that point, people thought that each machine did a certain thing and that if you wanted something done, you would have to build a machine to do that and that's all it could do. But this discovery in the 1930s changed our view. It was discovered that if you made the right kind of machine, and that's what a computer is, it in a sense could do anything 